Well, our organization consists of five stores. We are in the great southern region, but we are in Pensacola, Florida, and in the central division. We have five stores, and how we got into the business? Well, my husband John is that all-American success story. He started out at 16 for 75 cents an hour, worked his way through high school, through college, after the military. When he got out and jobs were scarce, his previous boss asked him to come back and work for him. Well, look and see if there's any opportunities. And so that's what he did. As what they worked out was as this gentleman expanded, he allowed us to buy 10% of each one of the stores that he expanded into. And that was three of them. And then eventually McDonald's came to John and said, it's time for you to go out on your own. And we looked here in Pensacola, Florida. And so that's how we got to Pensacola. I was a CPA and I had never done McDonald's before. And so for the first six months, he wanted me to come in, learn the business, since you know you put everything you have into the business. I needed to see what it was he went through on a daily basis. And after my six months were, was up, this was too much fun. So I never went back. <laughs> We've been with Kim Cannon Miller for 23 years. When we first moved to Pensacola, Florida, we moved from a small town in Iowa of about 13,000 people. So when you suddenly move to a community of around 250,000, it seems like it's just enormous. But you don't have any contacts. And so from another operator, we were told you know, to visit with, with your company. And when we did, they literally came up, spent a whole day with us, helped us through all of the paperwork that we had to do. And you gotta realize this was 23 years ago and things have changed and progressed over the time. But they made incorporating, helped us with our bank, all the things that you need to do and you have no clue that you should be doing them because you know they're out there, but you need the checklist, you need the people keeping you on time. They did this for us and they were willing to come all the way you know, to see us and they continually did that for the next six months. Every six months they came to us and now they come to us yearly. And it's not like you can't talk to pick up the phone and call them every day and that's one of the things we really, really like. Like, how often do you go to your accountant really? I mean, even if they're down the street, you pick up the phone and with faxes and everything, emails that we have nowadays, your accountant can be anywhere. And one of the biggest reasons we chose you is because you had, at that time, our first store was on a military base and you had that experience. Plus all the other stores and operators that you had dealings with, we needed that confidence and that expertise that you were offering us that we didn't have and you helped us with. We grew with you. Because years ago what they did for us was they were our foundation. They started us off kept us on the right track and there was a time we went from one store to three almost overnight and for any organization everybody understands the fears and the stress level that that brings in and what it does to you well when you have an accounting firm like we had they made that portion easy the bank portion easy I mean they took a stress level off of us that we can't we probably really don't even understand because we were busy selling hamburgers and doing that end of, end of that. So when you have that type of foundation, as you grow with other stores and you, you get up to the nine level, you do that because you had good people helping you along the way. And we thank them for that. And that's why we stayed. And that's why I recommend them to a lot of my friends.